Hello everyone, this is Yamel Kim Sensei. So today I will show you how to, to capture the packet at Cisco Nexus and Catalyst switches. Actually, packet capture is very powerful, but, uh, but it's very hard to do it because switch is not always with you. So sometimes switch is like a thousand miles away and the client is complaining Internet is very slow, while the ping is very nice. At the time, if we capture the packet, we can analysis. So why the customer is slow? So, so for catal catalyst, so they called embedded packet capture EPC. So catalyst 9000 or 3850 or 3650 or 4500 is support packet capture. Uh, so, but there is a kind of limitation. Only a physical port can be captured. So one at, at the same time, only one the live session is okay. So about the packet the speed it is only a thousand pps but there is a limitation about duration and size so uh, for the control packet to cpu ingress is okay but the egress is impossible so we can save the memory or flash but during the save during the packet capture also we can see it if you if you read it uh, the configuration is very simple. Just first, uh, we like set up the interface, also direction. Then we choose about uh, any packet or IP version four, or like version six or a Mac like that. So we can do the kind of limitation about time, and we can uh, set up about the location to save. Then start, stop. Very simple. Also, for the save the packet, we can see by this command, show monitor capture, file, brief, or detailed. So, let's do it. Let's do it. What's wrong? Uh, this, this is Catalyst switch, 9000. 9, This is uh, 9300 and version is, wow, 19.12.02. I, I, I think it was 16.9, I guess, but I didn't know it's 16.12, it's too high. But anyway, let's follow the configuration, let's do it. Uh, first, monitor, capture, interface. What's wrong? Uh, we have to give a name. Like a uh, test O2 and interface. Both. And we have to give uh, like a, we can say, like a match traffic. I will capture any traffic. For troubleshooting, I have to capture anything. Then we just to command each rate to capture. So we can check by this command. If you see it, like a interface is set up and packet capture, all the packet is done. So we can start the packet capture right now. So first, we will save to the buffer to memory. Just to O2 buffer is like size is 100 megabyte. Actually, 100 megabyte is very large. So, uh, because it's very hard to analysis. But, okay, so monitor, capture, test O2 to start. Then it should start it. Mm. But uh, we didn't see it, so let's stop it. Stop it, and let's start with the display option. Just brief. 
if we do this, first, as you see, uh, we do Control Shift 6, we can exit. We can simply read what kind of traffic is uh, coming and going. And if you want to stop, just Control Shift 6 many times. It did not work very well for me. But eventually it worked. Okay? Then let's just see the CPU. CPU was, it was okay. Actually, when, uh, when I started the, the test capture, as you see one time, CPU was about 60%. I don't know why, but usually it's like a 10% like that. Okay, let's capture the packet. Start and we'll save to the start. Okay. Then let's send a packet. Uh, I will send a packet uh, for 500 PPS. Then it's ICMP, so there is a reply. So it is actually a thousand PPS. As you see, it, it, it send a, a, the ICMP ping to the switch and get a reply about 20 seconds. Then at the time, you can see the CPU. Usually, as you see, it's a 10% like that. So it's OK. So let's stop the take capture. OK. If you stop the packet capture, you can see hardware drop and software drop. At this time, we have no drop. Actually, over 20,000 packets were captured. So, so we can export. Actually, we did the we did do it at the memory. So we have to uh, export export location flash and test to 2 by pps and eventually it 10,000 pick up you saved then let's get it by ssp command okay so we did it, we did it bring it so let's open the packet this far no okay so this is what we sent the uh, send and received let's count numbers it's exactly 20,000 so actually from here i sent a thousand a 10,000 a 10,000 the icmp the echo and I got uh, exactly 10,000, so it should be 20,000. So as you see, it's 20,000 and no packet loss. Let's uh, packet capture directly to the flash memory. Okay, then we can do the location file, uh, location. Oh, there is also read. The ring, if it's a ring, so we can save a lot, we can save for a long time, but anyway, we can just do one time location and flash and test tool 2 and it's uh, direct pickup. Okay, so now it's the mode changes from buffer to the flash memory. Then just and for a sec, then let's stop it. Oh, I didn't start, so start and start it. Then let's send a packet just to 500, then it can stop. Uh, about a thousand packets were captured within any packet. Dropped. And we can see it, show monitor capture and file flash 
And file name is test to to direct. Okay. Then just to, you can see what kind of package is come and go. And if you see more details, then you can, you can give a option details. Then you can see very detailed the packet. So live troubleshooting. So we can get it. This is about the EPC embedded packet capture at the catalyst switch.